Okay, we're working on a Ford 7600. This is the same tractor that came in with the stuck unloading valve that in my last video I showed you how to undo that valve. Now it's got another problem. Whether this handle is all the way down or all the way up, the arms still come up. So now we get to go in and free up another valve. Now, I've taken all the bolts on the draft cover off, and this is the only one I haven't undone. And I say bolt, this is the bypass tube for the cooler. And uh, if you don't get this guy out and you try to take the draft cover off, you're gonna shear this piece off. Is it getting it? Be real easy to move. Make sure she's real easy to move. As I start cranking on it, I'm, I'm off of the tractor, so I'm going to only turn the engine over by the starter motor. Um, the arm shouldn't lift in the down position. It should work like it should. Before, even when this was down, the arms would still take off. So, let's see if we fixed it right. <laughs> Are so good. Now we're going to put this up and see if the arms raise. Now the arm should come down, but since I don't have the bottom links hooked to it, I'm going to have to put some weight on them to make them fall. Let's see. That's finer than frog hair. So if your arms are stuck up and continue to go up even with that down, you probably have a main control valve sticking. And if you're in there doing an unloading valve, double check your main control valve. Don't forget, since I'm not on PBS, like and subscribe. It's viewers like you that make this happen.